This video is presented by the Cambridge Lions, the region's elite AAA Tier 1 football destination. Develop here, play anywhere. The Lions are proud supporters of local high school football. It's Football Fun Day at Glenview Park. The Glenview Park Panthers playing host of the Galt Ghost in junior football action. The Panthers playing in front of a big home crowd, looking to pick up their first win on Thursday. Jumping into the first quarter, the Panthers going to the air early. Anthony LaRusso lobs a pass downfield. Jake Sherist in on the reception. And Jake's good for the first TD of the game. A nice pass from the Panthers QB and LaRusso would keep the passing yards coming. It's a deep lob down the middle. Chris Brown makes the catch. And the Panthers set up to strike once again. Head to the next play and it's a good spin out from LaRusso. He completes to Nixon Ricker in the end zone and the Panthers take a 15-0 lead. Late in the first quarter now the Ghost offense in the picture. It's a deep ball from Marcus Austin. Lyle Fieras in the reception and the Ghost move downfield. The Panthers defense would turn the ball over however and in the second quarter it's more Panthers offense. It's a short pass for Jared Thompson. Jared receives and takes off down the near wing. It's good pace from Thompson before Terrence Smith takes him out just inside the Ghost 20. The Panthers move downfield and it's another short pass from Anthony LaRusso. He completes to Jake Sherist and Jake takes off left. It's the corner for Sherist and he's in there for his second TD of the game. So it's 22-0 Panthers. Anthony LaRusso having himself a game so far and later in the quarter. How about this run from Anthony? He laces up his dancing shoes and converts on a first down for the Panthers. And later on that same drive, it's the Panthers striking. Reese Cecilia in on the punch job and the Panthers are at 29. Late in the half now, the Ghost looking to get on the board. It's a good pass from Marcus Austin as he completes with a long bomb to Logan Dorsher on the wing. Jumping to the third quarter, now the Panthers offense back with the ball and have up the speed from Jared Thompson. He breaks into a sprint and Jared finds space down the far sideline. It's a stutter step and Jared keeps motoring and he's into the end zone. And the Panthers make it 36. The Ghost with the ball now and have up some late offense from Galt. It's another good pass from Marcus Austin. He finds Logan Durisher on the wing, and the Ghosts move downfield. And here on fourth down, it's Marcus Austin connecting with Lyle Fieras for a first, and the Ghosts set up to score. In the fourth quarter, now Sam Ghosts drive, and it's Marcus Austin spotting out Lyle Fieras for the touchdown. So the Ghosts are on the board. A big touchdown for the Ghosts, and they wouldn't stop there. Late in the final quarter, now it's Logan Dorsher making the catch in the middle and taking off. It's a foot race to the end zone, and Logan's in there for the final touchdown of the game. And the Galt Ghosts find the silver lining in this one. So a good game in Wixa Junior Football. And in the end, it's the Glenview Park Panthers winning as they take it over the Galt Ghosts. This one ending with a final score of 36-14 on Thursday.